Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a very interesting one because I will be sharing my makeup brush collection with you all and also I will be sharing some of my favorite makeup brushes and also their uses. So let's get right into so the So these are all of my makeup brushes. These are my eye brushes and this is all my face brushes. So these pink metal jars that I have, uh, they I got them from Amazon and I'll leave a link in the description box below. They were pretty inexpensive. So uh, if you're looking for some inexpensive and really cute uh, organizers, then I would highly recommend this one. So the first major brush set that I own is from Amazon and I think I got this a couple of years ago, like two or three years ago. And I'm so happy with this brush set. Uh, these are all the 10 brushes. These are five face brushes and five eye brushes. And I'm actually so happy with this brush set. Uh, it has been two or three years and these brushes haven't worn out at all. They don't shed any hair when you wash them or anything. Also, these brushes came with this uh, leather pouch. So this is actually very, very convenient for traveling. I absolutely love this. I use this every time I travel. So you get 10 brushes and a leather pouch for uh, 600 or 650 rupees. I don't know if it's still available on Amazon, but I'm pretty sure Amazon has a lot of similar brushes. I will leave a link down below of the good ones. I have seen a lot of similar brushes on Amazon and they come in all different colors, pink, blues and everything. And I think it's so cute. You should definitely go ahead and purchase this one if you're a beginner or if you're looking for some affordable brushes. Another brush that I own is from Ginger and this is a fan brush. This costed me around only 100 rupees I guess. So it's pretty affordable and if you're looking for a fan brush this is not at all bad. You can definitely go ahead with this one. But I don't use a fan brush anymore. So this is something I don't use that often but if you want to know this is from Ginger. I have another brush set and this contains only 3 brushes. And these were actually my first ever makeup brushes. And these are the three brushes. Uh, I guess I got this from Beauty Center. And I'm pretty sure they were very, very affordable. So this is a blush brush, which if you might have seen my makeup tutorials, I use this every single time. Uh, this is actually a pretty good blush brush and it f and it fits perfectly on my cheek. So these brushes actually had a pink metallic design all over it which is completely worn out. Uh, I don't even remember how old these brushes are. I'm pretty sure they're very very old. This is a blush brush. Uh, I absolutely love this brush. I use this all the time. If you might have seen my makeup tutorials, you know I use this every single time. Uh, next I have is a shader brush and this is very very dirty. It is a pretty decent shader brush. There's nothing bad about these brushes if you're looking for something extremely affordable then. Next I have an angled brush and this can be used for filling your eyebrows or even for your lower lash line. I have another brush which I use all the time and this is my absolute favorite eye brush. And this is how the brush looks like. It is a dual ended brush. And this brush I got it in the Modern Renaissance palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. So this brush came in that palette. Unfortunately you cannot purchase this separately but I'm sure I'll find some dupes for this brush and I'll leave it in the description box below. But this is literally the best eyeshadow brush I have in my entire collection. And you absolutely don't need any other brushes for your eye makeup if you have this one. On one side it has an amazing fluffy crease brush and on the other side it has a shader brush. This can be also used on your uh, lower lash line. It works perfectly. The last brush set that I have is my absolute favorite and this is like my best purchase ever. This is how the brushes look like. These are such beautiful rose gold brushes which I got from Rombe. I'll leave a link in the description box below. And these were so so inexpensive. I had zero hopes for these brushes because they were so inexpensive and so pretty that I thought that these brushes would not work. But these brushes are actually so so good. These brushes look very similar to the Wet n Wild Rose Gold brushes but these are even inexpensive. Uh, this came in a set of 11 brushes. I have 10 brushes over here and the 11th one was a small fish brush. I'll leave a picture somewhere. I absolutely cannot find that brush anywhere, uh, nor do I even use it. But these are the 10 brushes. I have 4 face brushes and 6 eye brushes. Out of all of those 10 brushes, these 3 are my absolute favourite. Uh, this one is an angled eyebrow brush and this is actually my favorite favorite brush to use for my eyebrows. I absolutely cannot imagine filling in my eyebrows without this. Then I have this powder brush 
and these bristles are extremely extremely soft these brushes used to shed hair initially when i used to wash them but as time has passed i don't see that problem uh, repeating again i don't see any shedding of hair last brush is this and i think this is a very versatile brush uh, i have used this for my bronzer blush and my highlight so if you have this one brush you do not need a lot of brushes and i absolutely love applying my highlighter with this brush uh, that's the reason why i stopped using a fan brush i enjoy this brush a lot so these rose gold brushes are something i highly highly recommend and also the fact that they are so pretty uh, that's the only reason that i bought these brushes so this was my entire brush collection i hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it informative please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys in my next video bye